Hey there guys, Frank and Maddox here with Sess. Hi! We have successfully gone to a place. Yep. And there are known problems with this machine. You know what that means, we are going broke again. What are we going broke with this time? Uh, that. Oh. Wait a moment. Okay. So this is elevator action returns. I don't know if we ever got the arcade version of this. I have heard from people on the Game Boy thing that there was a Saturn version that made it over here. I think. There was a Saturn version at least. What's up with the pretty squad? It's anime. Why? Why wouldn't it be anime? Uh... So we got characters here. We, we, we got six levels, two li lives per money. You've got a health bar that does not recharge between stages. Uh, today you get one dollar. Oh jeez, that's rough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I got four credits. I'm not that good at this game, so I'm gonna fail, probably, but let's see how far we can get. Pick my favorite character. The one who has the best gun. You need a bigger gun? Yes. Hmm. The wind blows hard in December and all that, yeah. So it plays a lot like elevator action, which makes sense, I guess. Yeah, we can jump, we can shoot gun, we can throw bomb. She's got the lamest bomb of the bunch. Object is still going red door. So, fire doesn't hurt you? No, we are for some reason immune to fire, most of the time. Crush the old order, by the way. Yeah, this seems pretty simple so far, right? So far. Create a new, create a new society, by the way. Create. Hey, buddy. <laughs> so yeah, that is a little different. We can't jump through there. I don't know why I came over here. I do that every time. Those items we can get out of blue doors, or if we're really lucky, out of boxes, like burgers and such, are the only way to get health back. Oh. Go indoor. Get a data. I love some of the delightful English in this. The first stage is very easy. I think on my best run, in which I wouldn't be trying to talk over it at the same time, I might be able to do it in one dollar, but, uh... I might have, uh... We'll see what happens. Been a little harsh on ya. Cross the breeze. That's not a good use of a helicopter. Had to get the launcher. The launcher is the strong gun of the game. It kills basically everything in one hit. See that guy being acrobatic? See yep. what it got him? Yep. Killed. 
that. Robots. And this is a mine. Luckily, they have a time to worry. No, a CD. Oh well. I could probably go back and get that CD, but I don't really care that much. You left behind some power, too. Yeah, I picked up the launcher before this for a reason. It makes this rush of dudes a little less annoying. I'm glad that a lot of them just land into fire, too. Well, that was due to me throwing fire at them. Ooh. <laughs> I never really make good use of my bombs. I did not mean to jump there. Now right when you're crouched, you just kind of drop the bomb next to you, which is... Totally useful. Yeah, super helpful. And this is already going well. And now we get to wait for that elevator to come back. Isn't that great? Yeah. Let's take a break, breathe a little. Take a break from creating a new society. Why do these guys in orange take so many bullets? Orange is the new bulletproof. Hmm. Whoop. But Fire is the great equalizer, though. Yeah, I was gonna say. Bulletproof is not fireproof. Rush the old order and create a new society! <laughs> Power of the revolution, crash the old order. I don't, I don't think this guy knows what he's talking about. Treat the bombs. Set oh. in a high building. Oh, okay. <laughs> I love the fanciful names these missions get to. <laughs> well, if you were naming missions, wouldn't you pick some nice ones? Alright, I found a box full of bombs. I don't know what breaking those things does, but you can do it, so I do it. Maybe it turns off the cameras, but I always just shoot the cameras, so... It 
seem like I turned that camera off. I have no idea. I'm glad these guys are willing to just line up to get shot in the face. You got point. I'm also glad that they took the time to animate them falling. And that you can shoot those uh, bags of materials. Look, I'm not killing anybody this time. I'm shooting them all in the knees. Except for these guys. So those guys are definitely dead. <laughs> that guy... That guy killed himself. And that that guy too. Yeah, he could clearly see that fire. He chose to walk out into it. Whoop. I'm real glad that some of these guys seem like they die from guns to the knees. Look, knee bullets are a very dangerous condition. So here's a fun part. I've never been able to make it through that part without taking at least one hit. I'm also not certain why the rocket launcher immediately sets these dudes on fire. But not the dogs? Yeah, it just knocks the dogs over. Look, we can't be killing dogs. That's that's not okay. Right? Uh I guess if you say so. What do you got against the dogs, man? I mean, they're trying to rip your face off. Look, they don't know any better. You don't know that they don't know any better. Dogs can only do what they're told to do by their computer overlords. What? I don't know that I like your relationship with dogs. Dogs are robots. These I... dogs are robots. Then why do you care if we murder them or not? Because that's rude. I mean, you're murdering the other robots. Like oh, that one. That robot has a gun. <laughs> the dog robots have teeth. Yeah, but those aren't guns. Guns are bad. Which is why I'm using one to kill people. I mean, kneecap people. Why were there like six dudes in that dude? <laughs> <laughs> Is that an unreasonable question? <laughs> uh, maybe. You know what I find kind of interesting about this game? It's got a female character in it. Mm -hmm. Since we're, you know, using her, that's fairly apparent, right? Sure. She is not the one that got the, like, highest move speed, which is what you would usually see for stereotypes in different stat characters like in a game like this. Huh. The long blonde-haired guy is the guy who has the fastest move speed. So what's the point of this girl? What's her gimmick? She's got the best gun. Or fastest shooting, I'm not 100% certain. It's a robot up in the corner. Yeah, it's not gonna bother me, it's fine. These guys are huge jerks. Which is 
why they get to die in flames. So what I've learned is that red is tougher than orange. And even though we treated all the bombs, the place blew up anyway, apparently. Now we gotta treat the bombs set in the underground. Just, just the underground. Under the crack. And by underground, they mean the sewer that is under the subway system, because, you know... Or possibly the second subway that is under the subway. <laughs> Why? That was a pretty jarring transition there, wasn't it? Yeah, quite the abrupt screen change. I think that might be one of the uh, video issues that the loading thing mentioned. Look, I want to shoot the camera, thank you. Why, why did you murder that guy? He was just hiding. He probably deserved it. Got away. Yep, see ya, robot. Yep, it's coming back. I'm pretty sure those are just riot cops that I'm straight up murdering now. Good job. I don't know what's up with the weird blue men. Zombies. Oh man, the zombies have learned how to use guns, that ain't good. Why is this guy blowing this place up anyway? I mean, aside from crashing the new order. Uh... The old order. And destroying society. I don't know how destroying the sewer is destroying society, but... Hey man, have you ever, like, thought about what it would be like to smell everyone's poo constantly? No. Well? Alright. Sometimes I can pull that off. Not that time, though. Another nice touch, if you're, like, standing right on top of the dude when you go to shoot him, you would just elbow him in the face instead. Dying to an elbow oh, in the face. Oh. Seems pretty sad. Oh, that's one down. <laughs> oh, I changed character. Yeah, they, the characters have different bombs, too. This guy is actually, aside from being the fastest move speed, the uh, middle-of-the-road character for weaponry. Ouch. This is going real poorly. I'm, I'm sure that big old hole in that intersection is fine. Don't worry about it. Crimson line. Uh, 
don't just know why I did that. Shooting those for fun. All right. Whoop. This is what I get for being distracted. See those electrical barriers? Yes. See that thing on the side there? It just blew up. Yeah. Now the electrical barriers are gone. Hi. Yeah, thought maybe that would hit. Gotta kill all robots. Except for the dog robots. Those you just knock down. Look, dogs are innocent. No matter what they do, dogs are innocent. Man, those elevators were all in sync and you ruined it. Yep. I ruin everything I come in contact with. With fire, usually. That water sure does look electric. Luckily, we can't get to it, so it's fine. about to lose my second credit here. And, oh, that didn't kill me. I was certain that screw up would would kill me. Don't worry, it's coming. Also the music just kinda stopped. Yeah, that happens sometimes. Hello, bad guys. I need you to please stop coming out of doors. Oh, I got you. Yep, I uh, screwed up the timing. Well, let's use the last guy, shall we? His thing is he has the most health. And the shittiest weapons? I think so. Oh, he's so slow. Yeah, he's also super slow, which is great. There's the music. Hi. He even runs slow. I mean, it makes sense. Look at all that armor he's wearing. See what his bombs like, shall we? What? Uh, that was weird. Okay, 
It's just like a shrapnel grenade. Which is different. Yeah, I'm not gonna finish this. I'm screwing up in super easy ways too much. Bad guy. The guy in red? Yep. <laughs> Get out of here. Door. Get a data. Go in door, exit mission. That's a data, right? Also, the entire thing blew up. They have a nuclear weapon. Go and treat it. May the power be with you. Similar to, but legally distinct from, may the force be with you. And also, the power is yours. He's our hero. Gonna take pollution up a lot because he just blew up a nuclear power plant. Or rather, an off oil rig. Same thing, right? Um, no. But this is a nuclear power plant. Actually, it's not. This is just a facility where they have a nuclear weapon. Oh. Well, how do you know? I mean, maybe it's nuclear-powered as well as being a nuclear weapon facility. The secret to not getting shot in this segment is to get into the middle elevator. And the jetpack guys will all miss you. The dog got you. Yep. That wall is asking for your help. Wait. Oh, you're right, it is. That's kind of weird. God, I'm not used to this guy being so slow, holy crap. The fact that my analog stick's a little loose and keeps making me duck when I don't mean to isn't helping either. Sure, blame your analog stick. Again, like six dudes all stacked on top of each other. I feel like I was completely robbed there. <laughs> yeah, at this point I don't have enough left to actually be able to win. I straight up cannot. Not like that, especially. Well, it's over. I've got this life left, and I can't do the final boss on one life. In fact, I won't even get there. Because this part gets kind of ridiculous. Especially, mainly, because you can't really do anything about these stupid timing barriers, and they're being dudes. 
Also, I took a shot that, as far as I know, is completely unavoidable because there was a cutscene going on there. Oh my god. <laughs> yep, that's it. You gonna take a loan or are you gonna let it go? I gotta let it go. Alright. I have failed. That's what you get for buying all those, uh, popcorns at the movies. Yeah, I don't actually see movies, I just go to the theater to buy popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what generates those comments. Oh. That also seemed like dodge the shots. So the real secret is there's not actually much of an ending sequence to this game. Oh. You get credits and then it just goes to the name entry. So you didn't miss much, aside from, uh, you go up with that timer ticking, the rest of that giant missile, fight the guy in red, and then have to shoot a wall a bunch before the timer runs out. Oh. <laughs> do, do you blow up the nuclear weapon? It's, um... not very well displayed as to what happens. The screen, like, goes white, and then credits. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like I could have done that had I made a few less really stupid mistakes. Also, had the game not, like, hit me in a way that caused me to lose a life from full health at the end there. <laughs> Anyways. Oh well. Later, guys.